Well, they are tiny, but these little bugs have the potential to damage California's citrus industry. ABC 10 News anchor Wale Aliu has been meeting with local citrus growers and agriculture experts, and he joins us live from Bonita tonight. Hi, Wale. And Lindsay, we're coming to you live from the County Library in Benita, where behind me I'm staying in front of the citrus tree, lemon trees, beautiful, but the trees like this can carry a specific type of bug called the Asian citrus psyllid. And the bug can carry a bacterial disease called Huang Long Bing, or more commonly known as HLB. There was already a quarantine in place in Oceanside and Rancho Bernardo, but now the State Department added a new citrus quarantine. Take a look at this map. It shows the quarantine areas both in our county and further north. As we focus specifically on San Diego, you can see Valley Center is now also impacted. The quarantine means citrus plants in the areas should not be moved to prevent the spread of HLB. Now, a few things to note. The disease is not harmful to humans or animals. That's the good news here. Although I got to tell you, it's not going to taste very good. According to the County Department of Agriculture, citrus infected with HLB can produce mishappen, bitter fruit, and the disease can eventually kill the tree, making it a threat to San Diego County's $138 million annual citrus crop. How big of a concern is this for you all? This is a very large concern. It, it's something that we take very, very seriously. Um, you know, citrus is over a $3.4 billion industry within the state of California. Um, it's a big industry within the San Diego region. And so we, we take it very ser seriously. Um, we also know that a lot of our residents really do enjoy their citrus trees. Over 60% of Southern California residents have a citrus tree in their backyards. The good news, more good news here, is that so far the citrus greening disease is not considered widespread and it has not been found in any commercial citrus crops, only right now in residential trees. So important to check your trees outside your house if you're one of those 60%. I spent some time with farm manager Michael Perricone in Valley Center. Some of his crops are in the quarantine area. He explains what they do year round, literally every few months to prevent the disease from impacting their crops. We spray three, sometimes four times a year for Asian citrus salon. And what we're doing is just suppressing population. That's all we can do. Uh, just, uh... I'm gonna have more from my visit in Valley Center coming up at 6 p.m. Uh, that's again at 6 p.m. But in the f next half hour, we're gonna point out what you need to look out for if you have a citrus tree, one of these bad boys in front of your house. For now, Lindsay, I'll send it back to you in the studio. Wally, thank you so much.